today we're going to try to get these bees out of this barrel. And we're not real sure if we're going to cut them out. Probably going to just try to cut them out and take all the comb uh, and the bees, as many bees as we can, home with us. So the plan is to cut the barrel open, take out as much of the hive as we can, take the hive over and strap it individually into this box with rubber bands and um, try to capture the queen and that may be really difficult, we don't know yet. And I uh, guess we'll find out once we open the barrel and then we'll take them home and start a new a new uh, residence. You don't think that the hive could break apart and smash? Well, it might could. It's been here a long time, so it's probably pretty strong. having to cut it in half, maybe even more, because that one honeycomb is like the, as big as the whole barrel, and it won't fit in our frames. Here's the first piece of comb that we got. This is the inside of the barrel. We have completely filled up our hive, our hive box that we brought with hive, and it just keeps going on and on and on. As you can see, we have barely even gotten through the top of the barrel. So there were at least 10 combs in here so far, and then we think this might just be all bees and maybe the queen is in there because they've got her surrounded or maybe they're actually just building more stuff but it's pretty crazy. Cool or what? and hopefully keep her safe. Got her in the little cage. Yay! Now we can keep her safe while we do the rest of our excavating. So 
how much bigger she is. Well, there's nothing in there. Their queen is in the new hive, so they'll have to leave here and go there. It's amazing. They were really about to starve to death, I'm sure. 